Dr. P. How are, Hi, how are you? I'm Katie. Katie? Yes. Oh, good to meet you and thank you for coming to the help desk today. Thank you so much for having me. Um, so I'm very lucky and very fortunate to have a good job that pays well and I'm doing very well with it, but um, I have so much anxiety, so much stress with it. It's just unhealthy and for months I've been telling myself I'm going to quit and then I don't take action. So I guess my question is, how do you prevent other people's energy from affecting you so much? So I can feel when there's toxic energy around, somebody's angry or stressed out, I take that off. Absolutely. Okay, let's deal with both questions. Okay. One, if, if this job is over for you, that means there's something else waiting for you. That means your gift and your talents and your skills are going to be used somewhere else. So you have to begin to ask a question. The universe, the presence, whatever, the higher power, the law will answer any question that you ask. So what you want to begin to ask is, what's trying to emerge through me? What, what gift is trying to be given through me? Or what's my next step? You can write those questions down before you go to sleep and you'll start to be guided as to what your next step is. Now secondly, the other question about how do you prevent yourself from feeling other people's negative energy? One, you become uninterested in it. You are not interested in what other people are thinking about you. You're only interested in what the universe is thinking about you. And what is the universe thinking about you? That you are, you're a beautiful expression of infinite possibility. And I believe that. You, you do believe I that. I do believe that. You're just sensitive yeah. to other people. So instead of uh, being interested in their vibration, you begin to impute a vibration, that is to give a vibration. So whenever you see negative energy or feeling negative energy, you're going to share love. You, you're going to give peace from yourself. It's going to lift your frequency so you become impervious. You, you won't be, be, be touched by the lower vibration. This means you're going to have to do some work. And that foghorn, <laughs> that was validation from the universe that you're doing the right thing. I love it. Thank you so much. Thank you for being at the help desk. <laughs>